So in today's vlog, you're coming with me from Jasper to this beautiful place, Lake Louise. Let's get into it. So you want to talk about bucket list trips, Pfft, ain't nothing better than this one. I'll be parked on the side of the road somewhere in here. Uh, so say hello there if you want, um, but generally we'll just keep on moving. And uh, so this is like your Rocky Mountain flat that you come across. So it looks flat, but it doesn't quite feel flat, so something's not quite right. So it's one, one percent, two percent, you know, it's oh, just, a, just a hair yeah. uphill and just enough to uh, annoy Make your legs a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, it's crazy. It's a crazy trip because you know, like a lot of people come from all around the world to do this trip. I'm talking with Ben at the tour company here. He's been saying like most of his customers actually come from America, Europe, Japan, Australia, New Zealand, and it's just it's, it's so crazy with that all these people are willing to fly out to here with their bikes just so they can ride from Jasper to Banff on this incredible highway that a lot of Albertans don't even go on <laughs> and Canadians have hardly ever seen or been on. So the goal of this video is just to give you guys an idea of what it looks like. And, and it's a nice little reflection for me to look back on and say, how good was that trip? Because so far it's just been incredible. The asphalt has been very, very smooth. And I'm just, oh, I can't, I can't tell you how many times I actually stopped to get video and photo today. I, there was, bighorn sheep, there was a black bear, there was this crazy, I'll get into it, I think I made some footage on it, but there's this crazy thing where this nice little creek was running along the side of the road and then all of a sudden it just like dumped off into the abyss. It just went in underground, but there's all these really cool rock formations around it. And it's something that you never would have seen, right? If you were driving a car and going at 100 kilometers an hour past it. But going a lot slower, you actually, you're looking around and and you see these types of things and it's really easy for me to be like, yep, let's do it and just pull over, have my camera set up my bag and run down there, get some really cool video and Woo. just wanted to give you an idea of what every morning looks like. Come on, Ben's got us set up. Man, trailer, bike's up, doing his maintenance. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Legend. <laughs> That's a setup. This guy has packed this thing full of goodies, hopefully. And yeah. Ready for another day of ride? Alright, I'm holding up the group. <laughs> I'm doing what I do. <laughs> Alright, I gotta get changed. See you later. that battle every time. Check out what that coffee's gonna look like. Oh, it's gonna be good. 
<laughs> the guy brings an arrow press, which I was amped for. So we're gonna figure out a way to crush this. So we don't have to. We all think it looks like tea, but I'm gonna give it a try here. <laughs> like a coffee tea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, day three, starting off with hills, rain, wind, but oh man, it was worth it. So just at uh, the first stop here, for the day. Ben met us here, so he's got the coffee ready. Everything's going warm. Mike's looking atrocious, but uh, yeah, tons of fun stuff. So yeah, here in uh, gorgeous Lake Louise, it's been, uh, it's been a hell of a trek, so it's, uh, it's really satisfying to get up here and, and ride up here first thing in the morning to be here for uh, yeah, first light. Uh, it was a heck of a climb coming up here. Um, but it was worth it. It was absolutely worth it. So getting up here before all the buses and all the vans is, uh, is something to do. And even though I saw a few buses, they actually went up to, uh, what's it called, uh, Moraine, Moraine Lake, which is another beautiful lake up the way. And then they come down here on the way out. So yeah, I've had this all to myself here and there's nobody on the path. Nothing but spectacular views. And uh, yeah. Something really satisfying about doing this and I'd recommend it to anybody. <laughs>